Hey guys, this is Dr. David Medoff from El Paso Manual Physical Therapy, and I want to talk to you all about knee sounds. You know, when you get that popping or clicking noise, or maybe you get a crunchiness or grinding in your in your knee. You might just pick up your knee right now and bend it back and forth and get that sensation, or maybe it happens after practice more so uh, when you've been working out for a period of time. And so here you can see the the knee. There's the kneecap and all this white stuff around there. Let me zoom in for you a little bit. All that white stuff around there is ligaments and there's some tendons there as well. Those can become loose if you're moving wrong. Now, if you remember, one of the tips I shared with you guys is your, when people take shots, the knees fall in together whenever you go to load. Um, over time, if you do that quite a bit, you can actually stretch out some of your ligaments. The big ligaments that everybody's concerned about is of course the ACL and then the MCL to a second degree. Um, those can, those are the primary ones that become stretched out if you're moving inappropriately. And um, so this brings up the idea of bracing, like using a brace to help your knee out. And it may actually be a good thing if you're getting a lot of clicking and popping sounds. Um, it's, the, the root problem is moving better, not letting the knees fall in and getting stronger wherever you're weaker. If, if you have a muscle imbalance, if, if there's, say for instance, your glutes need to get stronger, your quads need to get stronger, whatever it might be. <clears throat> but um, you know, get some help with figuring that out and um, the, you need to know how long you're gonna be using the brace because it's not a good idea to be on a brace indefinitely. In other words, without an end. You don't want to just live with a brace on the rest of your life. That's not a good thing. Muscles are very smart. They figure out real quick when they're getting help from the outside. And what braces do is they give joints, and in this case a knee brace, would give your knee some stability and it communicates to the muscles, hey, I'm getting some help from the outside. I don't need to do my job as much. I'm taking the day off. And if you're living like that all the time, you're always wearing a brace and you're, you're um, relying on the brace to be able to get through workouts, to be able to get through practice and all that, um, then you're potentially feeding into the long-term problem. You might feel better in the short term, but in the long term, you never fix the muscle imbalance and it actually just grows and gets bigger and becomes a larger problem. And, and uh, it's, a, it's more of a hassle to fix that point. So always have a plan. With my clients, we always discuss when we expect to start weaning off the brace. In other words, when we start, we want you to start using it less and less and then eventually cut it off and not use a brace so that you can rely on your own, your body's natural support systems, its own ligaments, its own tendons, and having all the muscles in balance so that you can be free when you're running around and not having to worry about a clunky brace slowing you down. Um, so, and this goes for any sports. We, we see this in football all the time, track athletes as well. Um, it, it's okay to use a brace, but know how to use it so that you're using it to your advantage and it's not making your problem bigger. So just a takeaway point here, a little knowledge bomb for you guys. I hope that this helps. And if you all have any questions, if you all want to set up an appointment to come in and see us and, and just get some guidance on the brace, please do not hesitate. Our number here is 915-503-1314. We can also take appointments online. You can hit up our website, social media. We're active on there as well, Facebook, Instagram, um, Snapchat, and uh, any of those uh, methods, shoot us a message and we'd love to get in touch with you so that you can not be lost about what to do. Thanks guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.